And welcome back to Jurassic Unicast. We are here at on our Minecraft uh, tour of Jurassic World, our updated Minecraft tour. How you doing, Steve? Yeah, good, mate. How are you? Not bad. It's about time we've done our up the updated tour. Now we've eventually we've we've pretty much finished the external part of most of Main Street. Now it's just the little bits and bobs inside that we need to finish yeah, up on. All the but, details um, and stuff. So this is the main area at the front here outside the Innovation. Um, should have a quick glimpse through the middle of the Innovation Centre? Yeah, we'll have a quick look in. Um, it needs a lot of work doing. Still. We've still not done the internal structure yet. No. Um, old little... We've got little bits and little bits of it, like around the outside, all the little TV screens and the... What's this bit here? The, um, the hologram. Hologram thing, yeah. Do we do this as a brachio or a... Patasaurus, I can't remember. I think it's a brachy. I believe it's supposed to be a, an Apatosaurus, but it's just not a very good job. Yeah, it's fine. <laughs> it's pretty hard to do on such a small scale. And then yeah. we've got, speaking of small scales, the Hammond statue. Yeah, unfortunately we couldn't really do much better than that. Yeah. In terms of how it looks, because of the, the lack of blocks that we've got to use on the PS4 edition. Yeah. But, so, um, it looks but yeah. Right. So moving down, we've got the labs, the creation labs here at the back. Uh, Henry Wu's office is likely to be on one of the, I think it's this side where the amber is. But yeah. we've not actually built that into the back of this wall yet. Um, yeah, and speaking of that. It just shows uh, you like, like, at... like the space on. on here. We have to build an extension onto the back, which the movie doesn't show properly. Does it? There's no way that you could fit the extent of the creations lab into that circle. Of... No way, no way on earth, yeah. So unless we build it underground. But as you can see, we've, we've, we've yet to, yeah, we've yet to build any of this stuff at the back here. Yeah, there's all um, the trees and then you've got the helicopter landing bit. Head eventually. Room over the back there. But if we head back into the innovation centre, you can see this is um a lot. Well, it's a lot better than our previous one. Oh, much better than our previous one. Although yeah. I did kit out the previous one inside a little bit more. Yeah, yeah. That, um, I think this one's a lot more taller. And the other one was just a lot more like pyramid shaped, wasn't it? Yeah, it was nowhere near as good. In yeah. old one. The Jurassic World, the Jurassic World tour on our first video that's got the most like uh, like views. The most views is probably our. Like, I wouldn't say it's our worst half. build, but. Nah, but it's nowhere near as good as this. No. So if we well, head over, over here to... on the right, yeah, we've got the T Rex Kingdom. Yeah. Which we still haven't kitted out yet. That's in the process as well. As you can see, it's quite. It's where we've not got the world edit. It's very difficult to do, um, quickly. Yeah. So it does take a lot of uh, man hours. Yeah. So we've got to add all like these. This stadium the alone log. was a pain in the bum to build. So. Oh, how long does this take? Probably about six hours. Yeah, well, it time. was a stair. It was all. The, it was. It was this bit inside of the 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 tier. The seats, yeah. Getting the seating bit. Right, but plane. the log and the trees are. It's not going to take long at all. Nah, you have to plant them, don't you? Yeah. And then we head back okay, out so, to see um, Stan Winston Steakhouse. The back in front of me. Yep. Um, just looking uh, at your we... extension at the moment. Yeah, I kind of made that in my little head cannon. To be fair, like thinking that if you go to the back of the restaurant, you'd have like a nice little lookout balcony over the back of the T Rex Kingdom, which I thought would be quite nice with a little pathway underneath. Yeah, leading which we haven't built yet, leading all the way around to the doors, which I thought would be quite cool. Um, it's not in the movie. I've kind of made that up myself. Yeah. Um, over nice here though. on the left, ah, oh, kick me out. <laughs> it's all right. I'll invite you back in. Invite me back in. We're having a lot of issues this morning. Right. So, whilst I'm waiting for you to come back in, uh, we've got Starbucks here on the left hand side. Not letting me in. Oh well, carry on. Yeah. Carry, carry on without me. It's not a problem. Yeah, you can add in your voice. It should still be recording. So, we've got Starbucks here. Which, um, we won't go inside, but it looks just like your standard Starbucks, really. 
and then we've got Pandora on the left hand side as well and we've got the it's like the little gift shop thing where Owen and Grey were hide from the Indominus Rex yeah traps inside and the T-Rex smashes through here and opposite this we've got the Spinosaurus skeleton and the other entrance to the T-Rex kingdom so if I fly through yeah. we made this a lot longer than what was previously on the film but yeah the reason being for that though is because um, like the way we've where we've placed the um, T-Rex kingdom it wouldn't it wouldn't work it wouldn't fit no like if you was to do it to scale so like the pathway it had to be like that you'd have to start building Main Street from about here which yeah. would then give you no room for the front path of the T-Rex kingdom yeah and also like you, every time you with thing is with Minecraft where it's done in blocks really like large blocks you, the, the smaller it is the, the more detail you lose yeah so, so we why a lot of I stuff guess looks in one a way bigger. it's slightly more yeah but we'll head back out and so this is where the T-Rex smashes through and fights the Indominus over here um, this bit here leads on to the um, what's it called the where all the baby dinos are oh the um, Payton Zoo. Zoo that's it yeah, it leads on to the Payton Zoo we haven't done that yet still got a lot to do uh, this shop here is the like camping tent shop I'm not really sure why they've got a camping shop on Islay Nublar no nah. it's a bit of a weird one and then next to that we've got the is this like a nightclub? I think it is, isn't it? Yeah, we I believe so, but we don't, it's not really uh, confirmed. It doesn't really say. No, there's no confirmation <laughs> or anything what what that is at all. Is there yeah. really? Yeah, and then in the centre could we've got be this... even could even be a cinema. Oh no, they got the IMAX and cinema. Haven't they? Yeah, I'm really not sure what it is. But in the yeah. centre we've got a T-Rex fossil head, just made out of wood. Again, it's like scale size. It's really hard to get full detail, but that's the best we can do. Still looks good though. And then opposite that we've got the Japanese or Chinese restaurant. I'm not sure what it is. Either sushi, or could be. I think it is. I think it's Japanese sushi restaurant. I reckon. Yeah. And, and then next to that you've got the, the bigger extended traders, Jurassic traders, where yes. they hide inside when the T Rex and the Indominus are fighting outside. Yeah, and you've got the raptor um, that flies through the window. <laughs> yeah. Starts chasing and, um, through here. Into... And then at, at front, this is what we've actually started to build, which is taking forever, is the lake. Yes. As you can see, it's not actually water. We have <laughs> Laying each well, we realise that water on on the PS4 because the graphic card isn't as detailed as the PC version. It looks like a really dark blue colour, like royal blue. Yeah. And it didn't quite look like look right as water, did it? It looked too cartoony as water. Yeah. So we chose that colour because it, it was... kind of reflects. I don't know. Right. I guess kind of like Caribbeany sort of lagoon sort of colour. Yeah, we chose cyan concrete powder delay it but again this is another mammoth task that we've set ourselves to do because we have to go yeah. down a couple of blocks as you can see yeah and that's the thing that's another problem with not having world edit either as well we can't sort of dig down and just plop it in it's all got to be every block's got to be laid on its own yeah one by one it takes absolutely ages yeah we need we need an extra person really to do that yeah <laughs> Um, this building um, here is the Margaritaville, Jimmy Buffett's, and this is almost yep. fully kitted out. I've gone for like light blue and lime green tables just to give it that sort of Hawaiian cocktail-y feel. Uh, got some toilets down the end there. Um, we haven't built the music shop, which leads on to like the Petten Zoo and the Paki Arena. I haven't built yeah. any of those yet. 
But if we move on down to the other side, we've got Ben and Jerry's in here. Which does look pretty good. Actually, I'll go in this one, because I think this is fully kitted out now. We've got What's that, the arcade? The um, Ben and Jerry's. We've got like, the oh, ice cream geez. in there. The Neapolitan. A couple of vending machines. Everyone loves. Got a lovely yeah. Neapolitan. <laughs> Alright, we've got the arcade here. And we're going this one as well. This one's pretty much finished. Got a little pool table, a little pool or snooker table in there. Yeah. A uh, couple of arcade machines at the back. Uh, pool cues up on the wall. Air hockey. Which everyone loves. And some weird little arcade machines. So if we head out. We've got like the sort of like picnic area in between the IMAX and the arcade. A couple yep. of vending machines, there's like a little garden at the back. And then we have... The... Now we used, um, we used Michael Pierce's uh, images that he used for his yes. uh, Jurassic World Explorer to help which us. Which out was, now. Which, yeah, which is we uh, were very grateful for. Cheers, yeah. mate. Yeah, definitely um, check that out. That's like a free. You can download it on the PC, can't you? Yeah, he's done. And a you full can just go around and literally 3D and explore Jurassic World. With he's even done three D animations of the dinosaurs as well in there. Yeah, this looks really just to good. Add to it. But here we have the IMAX cinema. Is it the Pterosaur IMAX arena? Yeah, yeah. So, Pterosauria. Yeah. Now this was quite an awkward build, wasn't it? Because we had to do it at a slight angle. Yeah, because we realised that you know, obviously Main Street, as as it comes out around the lagoon, it's not straight. No, it's it is curved. like curved. It's like on an arc. So the building shape does tend to go a little bit to yeah. whiff when you're building at an angle. But to be fair, you've done a really good job of that. You built that one on your own, didn't you? Yeah, yeah, it looks pretty good. But um, our previous video shows the IMAX Cinema inside and we actually built like a full cinema but we have not done that on this one yeah really because we haven't got the space really although this is a bigger IMAX arena we have to build the other one lower down and yeah we just don't have the space so before you may as well do Doesn't it work. yeah may as well make it look proper makes it look good yeah and then, um, and then got you've the got other... the, the gap haven't you next to it that yes. leads down to the T Rex Kingdom. Yeah. Which um, um is pretty much where we're up to on builds at the moment. Yeah. The the fence where the fence cuts off along the wall is where the, the there's a set of gates which will lead to where the uh, Mosasaurus Arena will be. Yeah. So um obviously here. we still haven't built that yet as well. Yeah. And just like another little information booth here. And that is it. But what I'll do is I'm going to fly quite far over to. Might take a little while. We have built. Oh, we're going to show them the pictures. Oh, no, I'll do the raptors. Raptor enclosure first. Then. Ah, oh, okay. Because whilst we're waiting for Fallen Kingdom to come, which we'll do a full Fallen Kingdom build once more footage has been released, we'll show you. More of Fallen Kingdom. We sort of started building posters. So we'll show you those in a second. Right, so here we have the Raptor enclosure. Like the Raptor paddock. <whistles> oh, I still got the pig in it. Hmm? Still got the pig in it. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so again, we built this one quite big. Well, a lot taller than it normally is but purely for details so we've got like the raptor cages and all the stairs that come up <laughs> so that's the raptor paddock there we go <laughs> <laughs> And what we do is we'll head over to our posters. Now these are ones that we're doing full detail. 
and we've had some quite good results. Last thing from. I think we just, this is probably the last thing we'll show you as well. Yeah. It's as far as we've got really. Try not to show him the half finished picture. I'll see where it's can it can help it. <laughs> we built this quite far out, so it's not visible from the world. But here we are. Let's let it load in. Right. There's a little preview there of the one that we're building. But it won't give too much away. So here we have the Mark Egbert. Um, Raptor poster, which I think was released just poster. before Jurassic World. Jurassic is, World was out, yeah. Yeah, we sort of did our own take on it because um, we couldn't get enough detail on the um, tour vehicle. So we just did the Raptor yeah. stand in front of the um, sort of landscape of Jurassic Well, he's just World. kind of like on the ground, isn't he? Like looking at, with a lost Jurassic World in the background. Yeah. So we kind of did it without the without the explorer standing underneath. Yeah. And then we have the very famous. And then we got the. Uh, mountain. Uh, <laughs> now this took quite a long time to build. And I think it did, did take a long time, but it sort of went from being nowhere near finished to, to finished really quickly. Yeah, I think from probably the bottom up to the nose and the ear. It was probably about a good like two and a half hours, wasn't it? And then from the nose yeah, up, the, it was the hardest done. bit. Yeah, the hardest bit was getting the nose right with and the teeth. The yeah. teeth were all over the place at one point, and then for some reason, when I looked back, when you when you zoom back out, the detail just looked really cool. The teeth just fall straight into the right place. Yeah. So I'm zooming out now. But yeah, from the nose and, uh, upwards was probably a good... No, I, like, I like doing the pop art style of uh, these pictures. Yeah. Is that... I think from the nose up, it was like 40 minutes, wasn't it? We had a yeah. little bit of trouble with the sunglasses. But that was it. Right. So I think that's all we'll show you for today. I think the video's long enough. Right, well, thanks for watching, and um, don't forget to like and subscribe, and we do most of our work on Twitter, which is at Jurassic Unicast. Thanks for watching.